So hey guys, it's Mel. So I am going to attempt to do my fall tour. I thought I would wait until, you know, my house is clean to the way that I like it and, um, you know, everything's put away. But with two kids, it's never going to be perfect. So what time is better than now? So um, I'm going to, this is going to be a long video. So hopefully you enjoy fall as I do. I'm going to kind of explain. Um, I was asked to just kind of show and um, just kind of say where different things are from just um, in case anybody was looking for something similar or price comparisons or what have you so um, let's get started <laughs> so um, I'll start here here's nothing big but here's our front door and I just have this little bow is from Joanne's Joanne fabrics and I it's like a little plaid fall color and it is um, I think it was like 99 cents because it was on either 60 or 70 percent off so I'm going to cover you up I'm going to show you this little area here so here is um, a little thing that I made and I think I showed this in my other video it goes down and it just kind of holds shoes and these little like rack things I got these little baskets from Christmas tree shop and you're gonna hear that over and over in this video because um, Christmas tree shop is the place to shop if you have one of those near you they're just the it's cute things without looking cheap but they are cheap you know price wise so um, you're gonna hear that over and over so I just want to show you my little decorations that I've done so so far over here um, I have this little plaque here I think this is from Johnson's farm which was a they have like a little shop in there it says see each day as a gift and I thought that was cute and it's brown so it's kind of appropriate for you know fall Thanksgiving ish so then here I just have a picture of my daughter this little frame is from um marshall's i think and then here is one of these pumpkins i have four of these total these two i didn't get to change if you watch my other video i don't care for these green stumps so these are the stumps i was talking about that's how they come um but i painted mine brown because i don't like the way the green looked with it i know <laughs> so you don't need to do that but here's what the green looks like but i will be painting these two brown because these two i just got um because initially I had the pumpkins here. I have them up on these two little pedestal things that my mom gave me. Um, this little thing here is from Ikea. It's actually a placemat, but I use it as sort of like a doily, I guess. This little thing is from Christmas Tree Shop. It is, I'm just getting out of the mirror. Um, it says pumpkin, apples, hay rides, and then there's a little arrow pointing. It has some raffia at the top, a little metal leaf that is like speckled. See that there? And then just a little top in the back. It's almost like a chalkboard, and it's got these little springy things. Um, and this was $2.99. So, and it's on behind, painted on a burlap. So really cute, $2.99 for that decent size decoration. And I just have it up on a little easel. Um, what else? Just have my Yankee candle going. This I got at a garage sale. Um, somebody, ha I have actually have another big bag of it and I just wound it around this tall, um, I'm actually trying to hide. We can't get this paint anymore and I'm, I have to paint my whole living room as we do our bathroom. Um, and we can't find this paint color anymore so I have to, I'm kind of just masking it. I usually have something else here but I had to decorate it differently with fall. And this is just a little picture of my hubby and Talia when she was little. Well, she's still little, but that was really little. So those two pumpkins here, and you'll see them, how they look better once I get over to here um, in the brown, um, with the brown stump. It's such a little thing, but I don't know why it bothers me so much. But these were $2.49. And as you see, they're like a decent size compared to my hand. So they're no tiny pumpkin. And that is so cheap. And I love the white, the new look of these white. As I said before, I think they're called gourds. So next we have, here's my TV. I'll just show you real quick, my little TV area. And sorry if there's a glare. This is a little carpet I think I got at Kohl's years ago. And it's really cute. It's got like pumpkins and different color leaves on it. Swirly pumpkins. And then I just have my, uh, ne next to the side of the TV, I kind of have that there so Talia can't get in there. And surprisingly she leaves these alone. And I don't know what you'd call these like greenery foliage, but it's kind of fall like it's got little, uh squiggles and things in there so they're kind of fun um so i just have this little setup here so here is a 98 cent pumpkin um and it looks like it's glass and this is from um walmart so 98 cents from walmart this is from christmas tree shop i think it was two dollars and 49 cents it's a decent sized stuffed pumpkin and look at the top it's like wrapped in raffia this is wrapped in jute twine there's burlap stitched burlap leaves um and that's just a mercury glass thing i have over there 
So not much over here. This is my daughter's diaper, little diaper container. But I made this little bee um, that I got from AC Moore. It's a wooden bee and I just covered it in paper that I think is from Hay Sailor paper pad. Um, this is Christmas Tree Shop. This was like $2.49. It's just a different looking green burlap pumpkin with the um, jute down the side and that cool curly um, stump. This pumpkin here along with, I'll show you this one here. Um, these cool glittery pumpkins and they almost they're not glitter it's like you know that sponge material can you see that Do I got you too close um, that these are really cool and Talia loves to grab them but um, that one is 98 cents and so is this one from Walmart and they even had other colors like I think they had a brown one but yeah it's like that sponge material and pieces come off and Talia tries to grab them and Talia take it took a bite out of these foam pumpkins so this might be my favorite table I think because it's calm so um, this is just a little area let me stand back and kind of show you this is a little area in my living room and um, just a little half moon table and as you see this pillow here me and my mom made this is fabric from Joann's we made both of these well I say me and my mom but mainly my mom because she's the sewer so I picked out this cute pumpkin fabric it was so cheap because it was on sale this is actually a handmade um, crocheted uh, baby blanket that I kind of stole from Talia. I got it at my baby shower, but I just think it's so pretty and like the detail work on it. I'm so bad. I don't want Talia to use it because then it's going to get all dirty. Um, but she uses it out here and pretends she's a ghost under it because you can see right through it. So she does get to use it. I just don't let it put it in use like in her carry it and drag it around. <laughs> so um, I like to put that up there because it looks nice and it's nice and small that it doesn't keep sliding off. Uh, from the weight so then here's my little pumpkin pillow we made and we also made this out of fur I saw I saw a DIY um, that's usually what's on there the, obviously the pumpkin's not always on there on this little chair here that we have so back to over here um, here's my little table this give thanks thing is from Christmas tree shop and it was $4.99 it's like on a little canvas um, and again this is probably better to be put, to put out at Thanksgiving but um, I just like it, so it's out here right now. So here's the two, them same two pumpkins, but look at them with the brown stem. So I personally like that better, and it took me two seconds to use my little craft acrylic paint I already had up in my craft room, and just paint the stumps brown. Why that made such a difference to me, I don't know, but that's just me. And then here's this little pumpkin that was 97 cents at Walmart. That's like that spongy, metallic-y material. Them certain kind of sponges. Um, so I have that there because these are like um, neutral tones and this doesn't even go this is for Christmas clearly and it actually sees a little hole in the top it has a little screw you can unscrew it and you stick a candlestick in there but I just like the tones and it was out here before that so I just kind of kept them out there so he doesn't really go but we'll pretend that he does okay moving on okay here is a bookshelf that is right so here's that little wall that's to the side of my TV and here's my little bookshelf um, so I'll just kind of quickly go over what's on here. I need to get a new picture <laughs> swapped out of my girls, um, cause Talia doesn't even look like that anymore. I got this little thankful plate from Kohl's. This little pumpkin here, um, these are just my husband's bookends. Aren't they cool? I think he got them at Barnes & Noble. Rodden's Thinkers, I think they're called. But, um, here's one of these little pumpkins and they're so, these are foam too. But they're so like glittery, let me get it in my hand better. They're so glittery and detailed. Um, but these were like three dollars, two ninety nine at. I got two of them. There's the other one. I'll get back to that though. Um, so I got two of those from um, Family Dollar. If you like that pumpkin, and they had a bunch. They had other colors too, like dark orange and brown, and a different like gold, real true gold. But I got the rose gold ones. Then down here is just some pictures and just this little pumpkin here. So nothing crazy there. And then the next layer of the shelf. I just got this at Marshall's. They had a bunch of different ones that say different things, like give thanks or whatever. And I like the one that said the pumpkin patch. So I got that. I think this was like $2.99, just like a little, little wood thing. Then, this I'm not crazy about, and I still have the tag on it, but that was from Kohl's. It's like this wire pumpkin. I can't, I must not like it because I keep going back and forth. And if you saw it on my haul video, it's got these little leaves on it, and it's just like almost like chicken wire, and then it has this little glass. Um, Maya and my husband decided to light it and it kind of went all over so I've yet to take that off but um, I, I can't tell if I'm crazy about it it's got a little candle holder but I mean it's cute and I thought I wanted to paint it and here's like the uh, how the leaves are like that um, 
tattered wood and I'm knocking over my little scarecrow girl. I'll fix her at the end. But she's from Christmas Tree Shop. This is from Dollar General. It was 99 cents, a little daisy. This is just a little um, gold sparkle candle I had. These little guys here are from, and I love them so much, and you'll see the other ones. These little guys here are from the Cracker Barrel. Um, I don't know if any of you have a Cracker Barrel near you. There's a ton of them in every state, so you probably do. Um, but these little guys are from their little shop in there, and I love them. And I got, these are my two newest ones, and I got two last year, and I'll show you as I make my way around. Um, and I just love them. They're so cute. Uh, the Cracker Barrel is a little pricey. Like, these were $5.99 each, I think. Um, which I think is a lot for these little birdies, but I love them so I had to get them and my husband and I and my daughter just got out and went there So I got the two that I didn't have just I was surprised they had them because they had them last year Down to my next shelf. So these are just two little um, These are like little leaf bowls. I think there was another one, but I think my other daughter broke it These are just things that you have to you know take a loss I guess but these were, you know, cheap little bowls. I think these were from Dollar General. Um, and then I have this little pumpkin here. This was a dollar from um, Family Dollar. If you have one of those, it's just a smaller version without the detail on it. But it's just so glittery. And it's just a little foam pumpkin. Um, then in here, I just got this from um, TJ Maxx. It says Our Family, and it's a chalkboard. And no, this is not my family. Um, I said to my husband, I was like, will you take a picture like this with us? And he's like, I don't know about that, but I'm going to try to get them too. And then right here, Miss P, um, I have to message you still. I posted a video. Um, she was so kind and she sent me this handmade um, crackle pumpkin and it looks so good in my shop look. And um, so I just, I posted a video about that, but she, she was so kind. She made it and sent it to me. So um, that has a cute little shelf of its own in there and I think it goes really cute with the chalk matches the chalkboard color brings the colors out so that's that shelf and then there's nothing really down below besides my little Yankee candles because my daughter can reach these bottom two shelves so that's all I can really do there because I don't want her getting hold of the things and breaking them or hurting herself so this little um, wreath this little wreath was from Target last year I don't know if they still have it but it's really pretty and has these little sparkly balls and it's really rustic on there and it has this little orange burlap bow. It also has a jute um, uh, holder, but I don't have that hooked by that because I want it a little bit higher up on my wall. Then here's just a little table. This is an uh, extra cutting board actually. Um, when we got our granite countertops put in, um, they give you a free, I guess because we, if you order so much, they give you a free matching cutting board. Well, I don't want to use this cutting board. I have a cutting board that I like that's a lot lighter because this thing is heavy because it's granite. And um, I happened to buy this shelf, I think it's a, for a planter, and I bought this little shelf at um, TJ Maxx, and I just used a gold leafing pen, because I like that with the rose gold there, and it fit perfectly on top of here. Um, so I used that as my little tabletop, so how crafty is that? <laughs> um, here is my little um, mini album, paper bag mini album that I made a couple years ago. This might be my most favorite thing I've ever made. I don't know if it's because it's the fall and I love the fall or just because um, the way it came out, but um, I promised to do a walkthrough of that because I had somebody ask, a couple people ask actually. So um, I'm going to do a walkthrough of that more detailed. Here I just have one of my um, mercury glass um, little candle holders and I just set the pumpkin on top of that. That's that other one from Family Dollar. That was $2.99. Here's just a picture of me and my hubby. Um, at our wedding. These are from Home Goods. They're these little, I didn't take them out of the package yet because they look so cute in there. Home Goods? Yep, Home Goods. And they're just these little like speckled pumpkin candles. I thought they were really cute. And then I just stuck two little, um, what are they called? Sprays. Um, just behind there just to add it up. Down there's just like a little chicken wire basket with just some balls in it. And then moving on, so this wraps around to my kitchen. And really quick, I'm just going to show you. Here's my kitchen. And I will um, go through there and just show individually. And then I have some more shelves on the other side. So down here is a mat from, guess where? The Christmas tree shop. I have this one and another one over here. These were super, super cheap. I want to say like $2.99, $3.99 maybe at the most. And um, I keep them indoors so they stay nice and I can just, you know, save them each year. But I thought this one's really cute. It says apples for sale and pumpkins. And it just shows a little form. So I have this right by our back door. Then I got this little guy. <laughs> he makes me laugh. So I'm a little, um, a little creeped out by owls normally, but I have two of them in here and they're not too bad. And he just made me laugh. And they had, so this was 2 dollars 
and he's like a little like slinky man and he hangs on a doorknob and his hat is, has a hole in it so you just kind of slide it right over your doorknob like that um i didn't think it would fit at first but i was able to get it on <laughs> so um this little guy I thought he was so cute they had him they had a crow and they had a scarecrow but one thing i will say at the christmas tree shop with some things like i really had to clean him up he had I, I almost, I don't know who they have assembling some of these things, but it's like there's no quality control check, sort of. Not to say the things are bad, but I guess that's, you know, when they're so cheap, I'd rather them be cheap and me pick. I had to pick so many hot glue strings off his eyeballs, off his nose, off the hat. Like, it was like they just, you know, quick glued it and didn't even try to just clean up all that mess. But again, it wasn't a problem, and I thought he was so cute, so I got him. And for $2.99, so he's felt, um, and with his little feet. And his little googly button eyes and his nose and his little hat and he's got a little a little uh, leaf on it so that he's just kind of hanging out on our back door and here is just another little um a little wreath that says welcome so it's kind of glary so you're not gonna be able to see that so moving on to here so normally this is the back end of my kitchen and um oh it's awfully dark so on the two sides of here I normally have um, some wedding photos but I swapped them out just for now and my it was kind of cute because my daughter and my husband said where's our picture at and I didn't even think they cared but they noticed so um, I said calm down they'll go right back after fall <laughs> so this is one of those prints too that I want to say was about five dollars and it is like all printed on a canvas and it says hello fall and it's like metallic -y. Um you can't really tell on here so there's that one that's a canvas I'm gonna cover you walk you to here and then this one says, I think it just says fall. And I don't know if you can tell, it's like metallic -y gold. And that's a little, a pretty little print, you know, right there. And then, let me back up a little bit. So, then back here, I just, this is something that's always there. And there's usually just a candle, a pillar candle on there. Um, just one of those little things I think I got at Marshalls or something. This is my daughter's little high chair. And um, I just put a little pumpkin on there, and that's a little pumpkin that I got from Christmas Tree Shop. Let me go closer. I showed this in my other haul video. It's just like a little crackle pumpkin that I just put the bee on. It was just plain with the white crackle. I think that was like $2.99, so super, super cheap. Next, we'll go to my table. So this is our table, and um, normally it's only like a circle, um, a small table that sits four chairs. And me and my daughter, we put the leaf in it in the, in the center to make it bigger for the fall um, in case we have any guests over for dinner. And um, so what I have here is I have, these are my normal placemats, and then I have like a gold one that layers on top of it. But um, I thought the yellow would still work. And I got these, and I just, so it wasn't too much because when I got home, I was a little disappointed that these blended in, and they're really pretty. They blended in too much with my the oak table. So... Um, I broke it up with the two yellow and the two end pieces that have that one. So these little placemats here, and here's another one layered under this plate. These little placemats are from Walmart. I think they were $1.96 each. So they're perfect just for fall, cheap way to just spruce up your table. Um, then this little, this little plate, the little charger, um, is metallic gold, and that is from... Um, Christmas tree shop and I think that was a dollar 79 something super 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 cheap this little pumpkin here is from Christmas tree shop and it is like a glittery gold with this cool um, little stump here and um, around here I got these from Kohl's they're these cute little um, pumpkin candles that I'm not gonna light I just use them for decoration Here's another one of my little guys that I got, and I'll have to tell you because this is kind of funny. My little guys that I got from Christmas tree shop. It was like a little ornament, and it was over at the Christmas part. I said to my husband, I said, <laughs> and he was laughing, I said, is this a squirrel? He's like, yeah, it's a little squirrel holding a nut. But the more I look at him, I think, this isn't a squirrel. This is a fox, right, guys? Is this a fox? So he had a little hook in his head. That sounds funny. With that had like a little jute, um, little thing, because I guess he's a tree ornament. Because they, in Cracker Barrel... I said Cracker Barrel, right? That's where I got him. Um, they have like a little a little shop set up for the you know the Christmas stuff too with the fall. So although I didn't pay that much attention to Christmas stuff yet because I was so excited for fall. So we went there and ate. I saw him. So I wanted to get him because me and my daughter, when we go out for walks, we collect, like if we find any in good shape, some acorns, some real life acorns. And we painted these gold. And then this one I left natural. But um, I think they look neat, and I'll show you in a couple other places we have them in the house. I leave the top, the cap, the natural, and I just paint them with this gold acrylic paint that I had. 
And I think he looks cute there, like a squirrel trying to get a nut, although I believe it's a fox, you guys. So leave in the comments below, I think it's a fox, because when have you seen a squirrel this color? But we're gonna pretend we're calling him a squirrel. And it was funny because um, we, I love my neighbors, and I'll show you this little thing that she got there. Um, we Maya plays with a little girl that um, lives next door, and her brother, she's friends with them, and her name's Izzy, and our backyards are, like lined up to each other so she'll come up to our back door sometimes she'll come at like six in the morning it's so cute and she'll knock on the door and she comes in and she just was in awe over this she's four she was in awe over this little squirrel quote unquote and i said don't touch him he bites and she was like you saw her and she was like trying to go touch him but then she'd pull her hand away so um it was cute so anyway th that's where that is from i think so i think i showed you the rest of the stuff on there then these two things are old 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 i think i got these from michael's before these became popular and now you have them everywhere they have them at christmas tree shop and i'm sure they're a heck of a lot cheaper than i got them from michael's because i think where they were i want to say t regularly 29.99 each and i probably had some coupon so they were they were kind of pricey but at the time i didn't see anything like that and they were unique and i just put a little pillar candle in there so it's just like a little pumpkin and it's got these little beads and then little metal um leaves and some of these squirrely things squiggly things and there's that one so um christmas tree shop has them and they're very similar i would get them there because they're cheaper so here's my normal placemats that we usually have out and then this is really pretty too a dollar 99 and this huge leaf and it's just it's the camera's probably not picking up it's so sparkly um they have this little hook so you can hang on the wall but that doesn't bother me so i just have two here and then one in the back just as like a little dress up thing for the table and then on my two sides i have my indian corn so i had Three, a stack of three from last year Indian corn because now they're all sold out at my Christmas tree shop and then a stack of three over here and they're a couple different patterns but I really like this one it's like a burlap with like a yellow like a gold and a brown plaid then there's this one and then I got that red one there and then over here I have this I really like this one this plaid and you know this the fall colors the autumn red and brown and green and then another one of these and then this pattern here so then I just kind of have them stacked in three and then these also have a little hoop if you want to use them as wall hangings the same as the leaf but these were $1.29 at the Christmas tree shop so yeah there's the little hoop so I just use them for my table um, and then I have just sets on each end and I'll just back up again to kind of show you so that's my little table decor set up Maya's enjoying it so we'll move over here this is my husband's little table he has his protein and stuff he's like a gym head um <laughs> he's got more motivation than anybody but um i wish i did so uh, but i'm doing good on my um i've been going to the gym and i nowhere near as much as he does but um that wasn't my goal i just kind of wanted to go to you know get healthier so it's going good so far but back to this these two are from christmas tree shop i left the tags on to show you get again look a dollar 69 and they're like these little wooden pumpkins that um have glitter and they're like all painted up and um they're heavy wood and there's this one and this one was a dollar 69 too and they have different sizes like they have taller ones and they're not they're 249 299 somewhere around there so that was cute so i leave his stuff out because he gets he goes to it all the time here's another pumpkin from christmas tree shop i want to say this these ones were a little bit more pricey they're 5.99 so that one and the one on my table um that's glittery too so I think they're around that price. And then this is my favorite. This I got at a, um, it was like a town yard sale we had. And this lady had all these like country, like, is this called like primitive? I don't know the different styles. And it's so funny because I kind of have a mixture of what, you know, I have here. But um, see, here's the granite that matches that <laughs> cutting board that I used as a table over there. But um, this was like a little rustic pumpkin that's made out of like that stick stuff. And it's got like a little bow. It's got some raffia on it, my favorite. It's even got these little like stars and this little like, I don't know, these little fall ball balls under there. And then it had a lights in it. And I didn't think it would work and I got it home. So here's my cord going up. But it lights and it's all, it's all lit up. And this is my favorite little thing. I got this at Marshall's. I put two little just loose these were came out of like some or um arrangement but i just took them and i stick the two um sunflowers next to it these are up all year my sister used to sell party light and these were one of the things i bought and these are like i actually love them <laughs> i keep them out and they just go really well in my kitchen so and then these are my backsplash that me and my mom did by ourselves and i picked it and i really like the way it came out this i got it was a dollar 99 from uh let me go in here and show you there we go <clears throat> 
$1.99 from the Dollar General of all places. I just happened to see it. And it says, welcome to the nut house. And it's all glittery and it's on this heavy wood sign. It's got this little um, bow thing here with the metal hanger. But uh, the cheapest little things, I love it the most. So that little sign hangs right above there and I think it's cute. Welcome to the nut house because that kind of describes my family. I got my little um, Scentsy lighter. There's the little other Scentsy one over there. Um, what did I call them? A lighter? You know what I mean. The tart warmer. Um, so that's that. That one's not on. Here's just a little Yankee candle. Um, here is another pumpkin that was $2.49. These are another one I liked um, because of the speckle. So it's just a really pretty orange with the speckle. And look, I left the tag under there to show you guys. So yeah, so if you're on a budget or if you're a new, you know, new, you have a new home and you really, you know, got to watch your spending, like pick up little by little at the Christmas tree shop if you have one. A few of you said you don't have one near you, which I feel so bad, but um, maybe they'll open one. This too was from the Christmas tree shop. $1.99 for this um, heavy, it's a large mason jar and it's brown in color and it's got a little leaf with a burlap and raffia, two leaves and then a little star cap, this little lifty up thing if you want to lower down your, see your little tea light in there. Then it has this cute little handle, but I just like the way it looks, I don't even have a tea light in there. Uh, these, you can put tea lights in, I have one, a little, um, what the heck are these, you know what I mean, these little pre-lit ones. But um. I'll have to get some more of those for there. That's just my cutting board. Then over here, I don't know if this, if he's getting the sun. Hold on. Let me see if I can get him to go. The sun kind of went out now. So I have this little, my neighbor got me this. It's like a little um, scarecrow and he normally does a little dance <laughs> um, because he's solar powered right here. She said she got these at the Dollar Tree or something. And um, I just love him and I saved them. And she's like, you can throw them away. She knows I love the fall. Um, that's Izzy's mom. Um, but she's so nice. Um, but she got me one of these and I think it's so cute. And I have it here while I sit here and I do my dishes. So here's my sink. Um, this is where Talia gets her baths for now just because it's easier for me to um, reach it here. And it, it just works perfect. So this is... Um, my I got this from Kohl's this was a little bit pricey but I got it let me see if it says it on here yep look $16.99 but I think I had it, it came to like 70% off but it's really pretty it's like ceramic and I have velcro that I bought that I want to just put on here so it doesn't I can just see my daughter's just like oh let me pump some soap and it crashing into the sink so um this is I got and I liked it too because this matches kind of matches my um fixtures like I have the whatever this is called with the rose gold around it like um this is what we picked when my husband and I were at Home Depot when we got this when we got this house um but I really love this so hopefully it stays intact and look there he is dancing <laughs> so sorry about the glare okay moving on here's another um Christmas tree little pumpkin and he's like I don't know I, I don't think it's wooden but he feels pretty heavy but they had a bunch of different ones that said like welcome harvest but I like this one because I believe that's a weeping willow tree and I love me some weeping willow trees so it's a weeping willow tree it has some pumpkins and it has a little fence I don't know if you can see that and then like a little schoolhouse or barn whatever that's supposed to be and then a little metal leaf with a sprig on there I just thought that was kind of neat looking this is another thing here I just have it in the easel but the thing itself and I kind of have it trying to hide my outlets for my husband's um, Keurig. But it says, we raked, we piled, we jumped. And I have a little picture, but I have to put that out. And I wanted to do it for the video. Of my daughter and my nephew jumping in the leaves at my sister's house. And um, I thought that would go cute right next to it. And again, this was $2.99. So it's similar to that one out there that said hay rides. But um, that was from Christmas Tree Shop. $2.99 for that uh thing there and i really like it because it's right by let me see if i can show you it's right by my sink and there here is some pot holders that are from their little fall pattern they're also from christmas tree shop i think they were 99 cents so nothing much over here there's my husband's keurig my knife rack and then here's my stove sorry i'm cooking um spaghetti and meatballs for my daughter um and here is up here i got these here let me show you these guys so these guys are $1.29. <laughs> they're like these little pom-pom. And they're not the, you know, greatest quality because you can even see like the glue that they just did. But um, here is a little, it's a little scarecrow. 
and it's she's got a little hat and I think this is supposed to be glued up so I gotta do some doctoring because again I had to pick all like the glue off <laughs> and you can even see some there so she's got a little bow there but I just thought for $1.29 that's the way to decorate and I love these cutesy little things so I got a red one and a green one they had a blue one too but I thought these colors went better than the blue plaid but for fall and there's another one there so you can kind of see the glue around like the thing but for a dollar 29 like you know i can deal with that this i made and i think it got wet right here this is like one of them little things from icy more and i just put my corrugated i traced it and glued it on there so that's no big deal little pumpkin candle holder from kohl's <laughs> sorry coconut oil nothing fun here is um that's just a sign we had out i keep this out my husband makes fun of it <laughs> he's like He'll like text me just out of nowhere and he'll say, how many times does that sign say family? Family, when you hear your family, but if you're family, you're here. Like he'll do that and, you know, make fun of my little sign there. But I think it's cute. This is also from the Christmas tree shop, um, $2.99. And they had a, a whole set of this. Like they had this, I don't know what it would be, like maybe a creamer holder. They had this little pumpkin jar, like a mini one. They had matching plates. So for really cheap. So that's just a little spoon rest on my stove um then we'll move to up here so here when we bought this house the man who had this house had like two cabinets in here so he was clearly a bachelor and we needed more so i actually got these from uh, we went on craigslist which is like a local like place that you can um, buy and sell things um so this guy was getting rid of his cabinets and they were like a wood color and i think it's pretty dark in here so i better move up so anyway we got the cabinets my mom and i we redid this whole kitchen um, like ourselves and my hubby's not real like um, what's the word um, like a craftsman so you know he was just like anything time you need help like he helped with the demo part we had to knock a wall down um, but like when we did these cabinets so I'm so proud